right, guys, so it's Nathan Mendelson back again with Travis Lindahl here for another Technique of the Week. Today I'm going to show you guys a little defense to when the guy tries to do the back step escape out of the half X guard. Come along, come along, come along and ride with me, and ride with me. Uh, come along, come along, come along and ride with me, and ride with me. Uh, come along on the ride, I just spit the song and then vibe And however long I'm alive, you know I'ma keep it live Leaving people deep in the sleep when I'm creeping Keeping them peeping the kid, check his vid to see what he did Uh, I ain't keeping it head, yo, you can check it out So, if I'm here inside the half X guard, okay Okay, I've got the guy's leg up on my shoulder, okay I'm hooking behind his butt here, I'm stepping on his hip, I'm lifting my my hips and holding here, I've gotta be ready for him to do this type of an escape here, okay? So I already have to be ready for him to do it, okay? And then I'm ready to counter it. If I'm not ready, then it'll be too late, but it's a really common reaction for him to do it, so a lot of times I'm ready. So what's he gonna try to do? He's gonna try to push this off, push this down, turn, kick that leg, and then he's free of my, my half X guard. So all I'm gonna do is be ready for him to do that, so as he, it kicks out. If my butt stays on the ground, then he'll clear this hook. So if my butt's down and he kicks, that leg's gonna come out, okay? If as he kicks, I keep this hook and I lift my butt to follow it, then I end up here and my hook is still in, okay? So I lifted my butt here. Now I'm gonna grab his pants here, okay? I'm gonna look to pull him toward me, switch to underneath so that I can punch his leg here, okay? And very important here is that I bring this knee now behind his knee. So once my knee comes behind his knee, I'm gonna pull myself in nice and close to him here. Okay, once I pull myself in close, I'm gonna start to kick him down. Okay, and he's gonna land into my lap like a big bowl over me. Okay, once he's landed in here, I'm gonna start to look to put my twister hook in. Okay, the guy here might start to try to get away from me by doing like a Gramby or something. So I'm already following here, him here. If he starts to Gramby, I'm kicking him down, looking for his bicep here, okay? Just like any other time I'm doing a bidding bolo, grabbing him the, by the back of the collar, okay? But I'm gonna start to pull him to me with both hands here, okay? So that he lands right here in my, my lap here, okay? Once I've got him here, I'm gonna reach around his neck, pull him in tight, okay? Both hooks in, okay? And I got him stuck. All right? Looks kind of fancy, but if you've got the the bidding bolo technique down, okay, then it works pretty well. Okay, it works really well. It's not, not difficult to execute. You just have to be ready for the guy to do it. If he surprises you with that step, you're gonna be a step behind. If you know he's gonna do it, then you lift that butt, keep that hook, okay, and then right away you reverse it on him and take his back. Okay, as soon as he lands on his butt there in that, that bad position with you with the hook still behind his knee. All right, if you guys have any questions, then Please leave them in the comment section. Please subscribe. If you watched till the end of the video, please let me know in the comments if you liked it or didn't. Thank okay? you. And I appreciate your guys' uh, support here on the channel. Keep staying tuned each week for a new technique. We'll see.